Hi, I'm Richard James Burgess of the band Landscape, and I could not be more excited. Uh, we just received, well, I just received this five CD box set that we've been working on for many years, and um, it's going to come out on July 21st. It's called Landscape or Go Go, the story of landscape 1977 to 1983. It's, um, I'm so proud of it. It's uh, 84 tracks, 52 have never been on CD before, 22 have never been released in any format before. Um, the design is absolutely gorgeous, done by John Warwick of Le Breton, who did all of our original design from back in the day, did the ads and Melody Maker and um, uh, our original uh, uh, EPs and uh, LPs uh, he worked on. So uh, this is something that uh, is very, very special to us. Uh, John Walters, our very own John Walters, a uh, lyricum player extraordinaire, um, <clears throat> has run iMagazine, a very beautiful design magazine for many years, and John oversaw the, the layout uh, of the set. Uh, so that also is something that we're very proud of. Um, it's a 52-page booklet with tons of uh, archival photographs, uh, oh, and this this cover here is the original cover for Manhattan Boogie Woogie uh, that was designed, this cover was designed by Peter Blake, who did the Sgt. Pepper's uh, cover, uh, was ultimately not used, um, uh, but uh, Peter very kindly gave us permission to use it in this, uh, in this box set. So, uh, all the lyrics are in here. Um, there's two essays, one by Jonathan Coe, one by Ian Peel, and then there's some historical information about our period as a DIY band in the 70s. This is the first LP that we put out, Landscape. It's an instrumental LP, has the 10 original tracks on it and six additional tracks um, from the same period. Um, it looks almost exactly like the original LP. This is the Tea Rooms of Mars album that has Einstein and Gogo and Norman Bates on it. Again, it's modeled after the original LP cover. Uh, it has the original tracks on it and additional tracks. And this is the Manhattan Boogie Woogie album. This is the cover that was actually released, not the Peter Blake version. And um, again, the original tracks and some additional tracks. We have two additional CDs here, one called Before and After, which is tracks we recorded before the first album and after the last album. And then another one called Excursions and Other Versions, uh, and two other versions, sorry. And uh, this is perhaps some of the more out there stuff we did. I mean, as you may know, Landscape was a fairly experimental band, and um, so we wanted to capture some of that. I'm also very proud of the sound on this record because um, we still have all the original uh, two-track tapes and multi-track tapes, and we were able to go back to those and re-digitize them, or digitize them, actually the first time they've ever been digitized, um, at 192K, so um, the digital sound is absolutely pristine. Um, the live tracks that I recorded back in um, 1977 on my Revox, uh, with all of our live gigs, were remastered by Pete Reiniger, who sadly died during the pandemic. Um, Pete was the restoration and remastering engineer at Smithsonian Folkways Recordings. I worked with Pete for many, many years, probably one of the greatest restoration engineers on the planet. So they sound amazing as well. And then we also have some live recordings that were done as bootlegs um, uh, at the Norwich Gala Ballroom. And the person that recorded them sent us the, the uh, recordings. We remastered them and um, they sound absolutely amazing as well. So if there's anything you ever liked about Landscape, I think you're gonna really love this box set. Uh, it comes out on July 21st, you can get it on Bandcamp, and you can also get it on our website. Landscape Go Go, Story of Landscape, 1977 to 1983. Thanks a lot, enjoy it, and let us know what you think.